Ladies and gentlemen, a couple more to go. Are we still hanging in there? Yes. Yeah. All right, I'm going to bring up your next comic. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, give a big comedy go. Welcome for him. Start clapping right now. <laughs> Thomas Jenkins, here he is. <laughs> All right, I can tell what you are all thinking right now. Yes, I do look good naked. <laughs> I've been working out. I am well on the way to becoming the man my online dating profile says I am. <laughs> See, now, now women tell you, they tell you they want a guy with a sense of humor, which tells you that women are liars. <laughs> they want a strong, sexy, Confident man with a sense of humor. The sense of humor, that's the icing on the cake. The strong, sexy, confident, that's the cake. If you don't have that, you end up with the kind of girl that eats icing from a can. But I have my dating red flags too. My biggest one is, I will not date a woman who says her favorite book is the Bible. Because I don't want to date a woman who can't read. <laughs> I'm sorry, of all the books out there and your favorite one just happens to be the only one they will read out loud to you? <laughs> no. They only read you the good parts. They read you the Moses part, they read you the Jesus part. There's a word we have for people who've read the whole Bible. Atheists. Because <laughs> if you're not one when you started, you will be one if you finish. Yeah, I'm not very religious and that breaks my mother's heart. I, I come from a very traditional southern family. We try and keep up appearances, but we're all a little weird. Uh, we're, we're just like a Norman Rockwell painting. If Norman Rockwell had done a lot of ass. <laughs> Got mad at my mom one time. I said, I'm not really part of this family. I was adopted. She said, yes, you were, but they brought you right back. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I try and fit in. I try and fit in some certain Southern things and try and work up. I tried to get into football. Anybody here like football? Woo! Yeah. <laughs> Through your powers of observation, you have probably noticed I would not do well playing football. <laughs> However, I was told I might be able to get into fantasy football. I gave that a try. I showed up in costume. I told them I was Thorin Punt Kicker, Dwarven Linebacker for the Mordor Maulers, with plus three cleats of sprinting, and an amulet with the enchanted tears of Tom Tebow. <laughs> Now, apparently, that's not how it works. <laughs> they told me, no, man. What we do is we take the player statistics and we put them into a matrix and then we determine who wins based on statistics. I'm like, wow. Of all the cool stuff about football, the athleticism, the violence, the cheerleaders, <laughs> You decided you liked the math the best. <laughs> so I stopped doing that. Uh, I went and hung out with one of my cooler friends. I went and hung out with my black friend. Anybody here have a black friend? <laughs> yeah. Two black people in the room. You got a whole bunch of white people that call you their black friend? Both of you? One of them sitting alone at the bar. I, you know. But no, as a comedian, you have to have a black friend. Because you can't tell jokes about race and not be seen as a racist unless you have a black friend. I have a black friend I run all of my black jokes by. <laughs> and that would be why you have not heard any of them. <laughs> but it's a special occasion. It is Black History Month, as you know. It's February. Every month is Black History Month. Don't be a racist. <laughs> but you keeping them down. <laughs> but, but 
because it is Black History Month, <laughs> I'm going to perform a special tribute song for my black friend. I'm going to be using the traditional instrument of the black friend, the drum, so one moment. <laughs> My black friend, my black friend, my black friend teaches me about Kwanzaa. That's black for Hanukkah. <laughs> my black friend, my black friend says I'm cool enough to use the N word as long as I just say the N word. <laughs> off the coast of Africa called Jamaica. <laughs> my black friend! My black friend got a scholarship based just on her race. She is 1 16th Cherokee. <laughs> my black friend! My black friend! Drum solo! My black friend can't teach me rhythm. <laughs> my black friend! My black friend got pulled over just for being black and drunk. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.